Hi, my name is Clint Brown, and I'm an area director for BNI here in the state of South Dakota. And uh, a few years back, I received the book, The 29% Solution. It's a book by Dr. Ivan Meisner. And it's really got some great tips in it. Basically, what Ivan has done is uh, boiled down uh, all these different networking ideas and concepts into a week by week guide. Um, has 52 concepts in it, obviously, one per week. And I thought it would be fun to start basically a video blog of the process of going through these. I encourage you to run down to uh, the local bookstore and pick up a copy, or if you're in BNI, talk to your area director and see if he has copies on hand or she has copies. Um, but it's a fantastic book, and this is what it looks like in the 29% Solution uh, by Dr. Ivan Meisner. And uh, I don't have any intentions of reading it to you. Not only would I be violating some sort of copyright law, but it'd be terribly boring. But I thought it'd be interesting to um, just kind of give you my quick thoughts on it and then see what your comments are back. So if you got comments on these different topics, I encourage you to, to let me know what those are and share those with the world. But basically week one, I'm going to try and post one of these um, maybe each Sunday, but here we are on a Friday and I'll get us going. But uh, week one um, is all about setting networking goals. And uh, boy in business, you really can't pick up any business book that doesn't talk about goal setting. And that's really true in BNI. And that's something I encourage my members to do and if you've gone through MSP training there's a goal sheet in there and uh, you'll find that uh, if you don't have any goals set it's really hard to know if you're making progress if you've actually achieved those goals um, and too many people um, leave a networking group saying it didn't feel like it worked well um, statistics help that um, and you might be having a bad day or not enough caffeine and you might not feel like it's working and how you feel about it's only a piece of the puzzle, but the the actual numbers. So, setting some goals, and <clears throat> Ivan takes it one step further to say, you know, just setting some goals is great and all, but they they need to be smart goals. And you can see the smart goals acronym with several other things, but uh, quickly the smart goals with the acronym S M A R T. These goals are uh, they're specific, measurable, attainable, relevant, and timed. Uh, is are your goals specific? Do they have a specific number? Um, are we talking about um, you want 30 referrals, you want six sales, you want a million dollars, what what specific number are we talking about? Are they measurable? Can you compare it to what you're doing? Um, does it make sense for your business? Are these are these goals attainable? Um, you know, you might join BNI and say, hey, or any other networking group and say, hey, I want to make a million dollars in a year. Well, that's great and all, but if you've never made more than 20000 not going to happen. So relevant, are they relevant to what's going on with your business, what's in the marketplace, who's in the group? Um, the goals have to have some to do with something else. Um, and then are they timed? Uh, do you have a specific timeline? I shoot for some 90-day goals. Um, you can have 40, four 90-day sessions in a year. And having those goals laid out every 90 days kind of helps you look back at the end of a quarter. I've got a quick story about goals being uh, uh, smart. Um, we had a gentleman uh, join a chapter one time. Uh, and this gentleman was in the contractor trades industry. And uh, he, he, his numbers were pretty consistent. There was a certain type of job that he did, on average, about six a month. And uh, after being in BNI one month, that number had jumped to uh, 14. And uh, he came to me and said that he he was not going to uh, participate in BNI any longer. And I said, "Well, what's your you know what's going on?" And he said, "Well, uh, you know, business is this isn't this is whole BNI thing isn't working." And uh, I said. Okay, well, tell me like a before and after. And he said, well, we were at six of this particular type of job, and now we're at 14. And I said, well, you know, I'm no mathematician, but that seems a little more than 100%. Um, seems like a pretty decent jump around here. And he said, yeah, but I was open for six a day. And I said, okay, well, you've been, you've been in this industry nearly a decade, and you were doing six a month. And, <laughs> you know, B&I is amazing, but six a day uh, may not be possible for years to come, if ever. And so when you have these goals, uh, make sure that your chapter can actually help you attain these goals. That was an unattainable goal, uh, and BNI was not, it was not a SMART goal, acronym or not. Um, and to boot, he didn't share those goals with his chapter. And so if you're part of a networking group and you have goals, share them with your chapter. They certainly can't help you meet the goals if they don't know them. So um, to go down and pick up a copy of this book and follow along with me, again, I'd like your video responses for the 29% solution. I'm going to post something each and every week on uh, on this book. I'll go week by week. Um, no intentions of reading it to you again, but just uh, to kind of have a discussion here online about uh, this great book and see if we can all become part of the 29%.
Thanks, and I'll see you next week.